Hi guys, Kim with Storytime Soap Shop. Today we're going to be making some monkey farts soap. Now, monkey farts is one of those things that gives kids a really big giggle when they see the, the label. And uh, the bath bombs go really well, so we're going to be making some monkey farts soap today. And I'm using a new fragrance from, I think, Nature's Garden. Um, but I chose some fun neon colors to kind of go with this for the kids. So, enough of me chat and let's go make some soap. In my pot, I have coconut sustainable palm, olive, and some shea butter all melted down. Now I melted these yesterday and let them sit overnight. And since this is monkey farts, and the kids usually buy it, I tried to make sure I chose a fun color palette. A monkey farts, if you've never smelled it, um, is a blend of bananas, berries, vanilla. It's really lovely, actually. Alright, so we're going to burp our blender here. Now I'm going to divide this up between my bowls. All of these neons that I'm using are from Nurture Soap Supply. This is the neon green. The neon purple. I'm going to go ahead and pour everything out of my big bucket here. So it'll be easier to pour and we'll scrape that up when we're done. This is some titanium dioxide dissolved in a little warm distilled water. And finally, our neon pink. We'll scrape off the pot and we'll be right back. Okay, we will start with the white. We're half in there, half in there. I think we will go with the drop swirl, the purple on one side. And it made a little spill, but that's okay. 
I love these five pound molds from Nurture, but man, they need to make these uh, liners just a tiny bit skinnier. And we'll go with the green over here. Is starting to thicken up just a bit. Then we'll go with the pink. We will start scraping out our bowls to fill up the rest of the soap molds. Okay, so if you're going to use this fragrance oil, as I said, these were room temperatures, lye, room temperature lye water and oil that I whipped up yesterday and let sit. And this is really thickening up. So it's not a slow moving fragrance oil by any stretch of the imagination. And it does rise a little bit, but so far so good. the remainder of the pink. Let's see. Okay, I'm going to give these a tap. <coughs> and we're just going to swirl the top here. We will be back in 24 hours to cut the soap and see. We're back the next day to cut the monkey fart soap, and as you can see, the neons didn't stay quite so neon, but they are pretty vibrant on top and inside. Looks pretty good. Again, not really what I would consider neon, but it is pretty vibrant. I did still wind up with a little bit of glycerin rippers, but I can live with that. 